Hello, hello, hello. So this is the new APM planner running on my MacBook Air. There you are, there's the MacBook Air. And uh, apologies for the handshake, uh, it's a handheld camera. Uh, I just want to take you through, just show you a little bit how it's doing, not very much really. So, um, at the moment I've got a good lock, uh, GPS lock. You may just be able to see um, the information there. It's not very clear on this display um, because of the lettering. And I've got it set on indoor mode. It may be better on daylight mode. There's several modes you can set on there, but you can see the classic. Um, pardon me, that's just the lost craft alarm. It goes on every minute. Uh, so you can see the classic uh, head up display on the left hand side. Um, but I've got myself a reasonably good uh, GPS fix. Um, H DOP is nice and low, 2.2 at the moment. Um, it's a nice display there, and you can change it through just like uh, sorry, you can change it like normal. Um, right, so I just want to show you it talks to you by default. So when you do stuff, um, so right now I've got it in stabilized mode, as you can see. And as I change the modes, mode change to all hold for system one. I presume system one is the first APM it's discovered. Mode change to loiter for system one. Mode change to stabilize for system one. Mode change to drift for system one. Mode change to land for system one. And somewhere. Mode change to RTL for system one. So that's really quite nice actually. So if you've got this running. Mode change. Mode change to stabilize for system one. So I guess if you've got this running uh, beside you while you're flying, um, using it as a ground control station with telemetry. Uh, you've got it talking to you nice and loudly, uh, which is quite good. And I guess you could probably put headphones on as well if you needed to. Um, now the other thing I want to show you uh, will be the change in the configuration. Now I hope I can remember how to do this uh, fairly quickly. Um, where the hell was it? I'm probably going to not be able to do this now because I think I've suddenly forgotten where to do where all the controls are. Um, Oh, I have forgotten where to set it up. Uh, but there was a setting there to change the screen display and stuff like that. Oh, there it is up there. I think. Views. No, I probably should have planned this a little bit better. Uh, can't quite figure out how to work it. Uh, it's all a little bit new to me. Um, display. No. Anyway, uh, so this is it. It runs on either. Excuse me. It runs on either Windows or uh, Mac, and we are promised a Linux version uh, sometime real soon now. So there you go, the new APM planner from the Ardicopter team.